Minnesota parents hoping for answers and relief from the governor as the nationwide baby formula shortage stretches on. Our Karen Scullin joins us now. And Karen, many of them want to know what's being done at the state level to address the shortages. What did the governor have to say about it? Well, at the table, Randy, were moms, hy V, a doctor, and WIC. But when it comes to what can be done here and now, the answer seemed to be not a lot. The stars of this show are easily 10-month-old Whitney and little Remy. Tummies full, they're sweet and content, and their moms are working to keep it that way. It's a health crisis. Like, how do we feed these kids? They're worried about something so basic, and today the governor is listening. First and foremost, um, this is one and an issue that there really is no important issue. How do you feed your children? Tracking down formula has been extremely difficult. Calling stores, calling friends overseas, and hoping they have enough to feed their little ones. I check pretty much every day. Every pharmacy, um, online, big box retail, Costco, um, you name it. We are really using our village to try and find formula. So um, grandmas, friends, um, the Buy Nothing neighborhood group, someone had a can that they gave me. The governor says in four to six weeks the situation should improve, but that's a big chunk of time when your baby is hungry. Like the four to six weeks is like Cool, but like, what do we do in those four to six weeks? Yeah, it's a really that's exactly right. long time. Like Whitney, she's she does five six ounce bottles a day. Long term, the governor is looking at having a 30 day supply on hand should something like this happen again. But short term, it seems at the state level, there's not much in the works to really help. So we're kind of just riding on faith now that in a month when the formula runs out, they'll be, you know. There'll be an alternative or there'll be something available. You know, it feels a little reminiscent of trying to chase your vaccine. It does. And I did ask if anything is in the works at the state level to maybe make calls to lesser known retailers, maybe outside of the metro. The answer, though, appeared to be no. But again, there are some talks some things in the work works to kind of prevent this maybe from happening in the future, like mm -hmm. was mentioned in the story there, like a 30 day supply or something like that. But the here and now is, is it, kind of scary. It seems like it's really hard to find solutions. At right. This point, and we've got sounds like four to six weeks of this. Scary still. worries. Not a lot of comfort for families out there. No. All right. Thanks, Karen.